Hey, Hudlum. Good morning or evening, afternoon for you. Good time zone. I started the stream and then stepped away to go pour my coffee and stuff. So sorry if you were here talking at me and I was not here. How are you? Um. Oh, nice. What was for dinner? Also, uh, just leaving this on the start screen so I can take my meds. And then we can start. And this is a bonus stream. This is going to be like super chill. No, no real agenda. Just getting through stuff. Because act three is a lot, a lot. Yeah, it is medication o'clock here, so. Ooh, that sounds nice. Yeah, I need to buy some groceries and cook this week. Hey, Puddle. Yeah, I wish it was just antihistamines. I'm now on two daily medications and one that is once a week. And I need to take iron pills. Actually, two that are once a week. goes puddle are you up for the chickens as well all right oh yeah everyone has to level should get fireball too though remove curse is useful oh woof what should I take he's got a modded thing So I think Gale has removed curse as well. Hey, Steph, how are you? 78 months, holy shit. That is so much. I take fear. Oh no, I'm sorry. I'm so excited I get to see you later this year. Ooh, Cone of Cold does obscene damage. I forgot about Hold Monster. Hold Monster, I didn't realize, would come in real handy when you fight Raphael. I'm like, oh. Lightning Witch Bolt. Blight is a disgusting spell, too. How are you, Steven? 
Yeah, it does not seem like it's been over six years. Holy shit. So you get 66, still get 66, but I have to pick a subclass. So, okay is, is a matter of well, I'm here. I'm going to give him detect thoughts. Red, good morning. Or afternoon for you, I should say. Hello, hello. I'm up before the chickens, so... Uh... Oh, mass cure wounds? Absolutely. and I need you to be your druidic best. And eh, greater restoration's fine. Thank you. So, uh, this is actually a modded outfit. Oh, hold on. Uh, Selena Price told me about um, this outfit mod. It basically gives alt versions of a lot of the in-game stuff. So like, this is more like what I would expect an arch druid to wear versus um, what he starts off in. And this, this is in the game, it's just, people just basically made their outfits kind of OP. Also, you're in camp, please wear your camp clothes. Um, oh, really? Cool, cool, cool. I think I've talked to everyone. This is where you go sleep. And then the Githyanki attack. I, yeah, I talked to everybody. Like, can I just go to sleep? I am. How are you, Red? How is the new printer? This better be good. Yo, good berries. I'll take it. And this is an extra stream. I had no intent of streaming today or tomorrow, but... I'm up before the chickens, so. Oh, that's so cool. I'm so glad to hear it. The events of the last days weigh heavily upon you. Sleep's rest is slow to come to one whose mind is so full. The Absolute is not a god, but an elder brain controlled by the Chosen of the Dead Three. They mean to use it to take control of the Sword Coast. All who carry the tadpole are nice. governed by the brain and by extension the chosen. It will take but one order to transform Earth, them into an army of mind flayers. This would have been your fate too, were it not well, for I the hope you have a good flight wherever you're going. And the mysterious visitor inside of it. With his help, you have uncovered the cult for what it really is. A plan of conquest orchestrated by the gods of death themselves. Together, you have the power to thwart the dead three. If you follow this path to its end, the Elder Brain will not answer to the Chosen. It will answer to you. If the Dream Visitor speaks true, then the entire Sword Coast is under threat. It will take a true hero to save it. Mm. But is that really you? You who are a plaything for a Cambion. Ooh. You who bear the face of a devil. Will you liberate the true souls from their parasites and their religious delusions? 
Or will you use the power you gain for your own purposes? Ooh. And what of your father? Will you tear him away from the Elder Brain's clutches? Or allow him to suffer? Oh, interesting. So I'm playing a Will Origin. Also noted, uh, Liz is fun. A thrill courses through you at the thought. You will not have long to wait. All you need to do now is sleep. But sleep is not for you. So my theory is if someone goes bad and join we'll becomes the absolute help me or we lose everything is that nobody lets you get a good night's sleep like they literally will not let you fucking rest let's give this a try hey Jory I love this so much. I want to make a wallpaper out of it. That's all was going to blow. And soon. This fight also fucked me up. I did not know what to do the first time. Some of the NPCs have the modded outfits, which I didn't think would happen. Ah, oh, shit. I'm here. Help me. I'm under attack. Uh, oh, that's right. We have to jump. Me, why can't I get here? A hero at heart. Best foot forward. It truly is, and I'm like, if I go evil, this is why. Mm. I applaud your taste. Yeah. What a day. Okay, why don't you all jump with everyone? What is needed? That annoys the absolute fuck out of me. Also, why? Why is my healing not all together? Sorry, I'm having a moment about this being so disorganized. Like, literally, why are you like this? What just happened? I heard a noise, but I did not see an alert. Oh, thank you for the sub. I appreciate it. I also thought I got rid of Moonbeam. Oh, I get more spells? Oh, shit. Hey, Karajan, and thank you for your sub. 
Oh, I was gonna jump Halston over and then I got distracted. May the dice roll in my favor. Hey, Karjan. Thank you for your resub. Hello, hello. That may be overkill. It's not over. Come to the skull. Wow, they really said come over here right now. Surprises. Y'all cause all this problems and ain't even got loot. Also, I'm so sorry you're at the airport that early. It's not over. Come to the skull. Bro. Hurry. Let me I get can't there. hold them back alone. Could come in handy. Mm. Right? So question. Has anyone um based on what's skull. about to happen? Has anyone sided with the Dream Guardian once you know the truth? We're about to reveal that of who and what the Dream Guardian actually is. Ah. South Africa is on my list of places I'd like to go. But I know it's like, for me, it would be almost a day and a half of travel, no matter how you kind of parse it out. Before we oh, what happened, Ryan? I am your ally. We are in danger. Who a mind is flayer? Me? the blazes is going on here? The Githyanki is the source of our protection against the Absolute. I must subdue him, or everything we've worked towards is lost. I'm Don't sorry, what? let my form deceive you. Uh, I hey, am the one that's been protecting is you. Is it? I didn't kill the her. The last time you were here, you tried to kill me. Not far from this very spot. Right? Your continued existence as yourself and not a mind flayer should be all the proof you need. Now, help me. The God. Destroy the God. They prevent me from subduing their master. I'm interested to see how that changes things. Damn. Oh, that's right. We're not fully rested because the game interrupted our sleep. Right? I just wish... It 
work for other body types? The person who made it only made it for body t like body type 2, which is the standard mask body. If you put on anyone else, it doesn't work. Yo! Yeah, because I really wanted to put that coat on Carlac. Oh, stage fright. But everyone's too clumped up together. Yes. You didn't die? What the hell are y'all made out of? Oh, brain puppy's dead. Well, ooh, I wonder if planar binding. Oh, they have to be a celestial. Okay. Well, shit. Well. Yeah, I was hoping that... I was hoping... Oh, growing spikes did nothing. Dang it. Whatever may come, I stand ready. Oh, I summoned her. She immediately got her turn. Cool, cool, cool. I'm not sure what I could do as a badger. I was just hoping I could use it. Because I forget about that ability and then I never use it like in the few, the few chances you have to use it. Damn. Y'all really did not want me to kill this good Yankee. Oh, since you're right in front of me. Seriously? Sorry, I've gone quiet. I'm, I'm, I'm thinking. Yo! Rude! Oh, thanks for jumping down here. <gasps> I missed!
now that the fight's done, how's everyone doing? How's your weekend going? Thank you. That was too close. Don't look at me like that. Oh, I, I will. I am a mind flayer. Yes. Without me, you would be a slave to the absolute. A mind flayer? Not the savior I've been hoping for. It was necessary. Rare are those that would openly consider a partnership with a Mind Flayer. Even those who are on a path of becoming one. Um, about it's like who I he was? Said before, I'm just like you. Because I know if you do the thing with the dragon... An adventurer. I came from Baldur's Gate. Though I was never one to be constrained by Uh, this part or something else? I longed for more. That longing brought me to Moonrise Towers on a search for treasure. To a colony of Mind Flayers who caught me, changed me into what I am now. Damn, how long have these Mind Flayers been in Moonrise? For years, I served the Elder Brain. The one you know as the Absolute. I was a thrall like any other, but I was fortunate. I broke free and started a new life in my old city. I sustained myself on criminals. Unglamorous, but there are plenty of them. Rarely missed. And they fueled me while I did my work. Uh, Red, I you mean other lore? To or meet this part? Stillman. We formed a partnership. And through her, I became the governing force behind the Knights of the Shield. The largest mercantile operation in Baldur's Gate. People refer oh. to me as the Emperor. I don't. Actually. Such was my influence. Though of course they had no idea what I really was. How? My needs were sated. I was happy for a while. Until my true nature was discovered by the tyrant himself, Lord Gortash. He tore me from my home. And brought me back to the brain, where I became a slave once again. A slave he continued to call the Emperor. The name was intended as a slight, to remind me of the heights from which I fell. But I have grown fond of it. It encapsulates well who I've become. Indeed, his hubris knows no bounds. To enslave me, that was his nature. But to enslave an elder brain, a questionable decision. I shall look forward to sharing his downfall with you. Not all mind flayers are alike. I have always valued freedom above all else. In my past life, and present. It has been a burning need within me for as long as I can remember. Uh, share Red if you want. Because I know there's a bit more if you do the dragon thing under... Um... Gortash sent me on a mission to retrieve the Astral Prison. I was one of many, but the first to find it. How Gortash or the other Chosen learned of its existence... I do not know. Yes. The moment I found it, I felt a change. My free will returning. I followed the feeling inside and found the Gith Yankee. I realized what the prison was for containment. While my body was within the prison's bounds, my mind was free. I could resist the Elder Brain, the Chosen. Better yet, oh. I could plan to overthrow them. All I needed to do was subdue the Githyanki and find allies in the outer world. You. Interesting. Prince Orpheus, son of the first leader of the Githyanki. His power has been the source of your continued protection against the voice of the Absolute. 
the power to disrupt hive mind communication. It is the same power that enabled Orpheus, his mother, to bring about the fall of the Elithid Empire eons ago. A power she passed on to him, and that I leveraged for you. When Orpheus' mother left, a usurper took her place. Blacketh declared herself queen of the Githyanki. Blacketh oh, wanted his power, but Orpheus rose against her, and so she sealed him and his honor guard within this prison. Bound by infernal chains, Orpheus could never leave. Bound by duty, his guard never would. They were close to breaking my hold on that prince. And if they had succeeded, we would be lost. I oh, am relieved. very interesting. You have embraced your potential enough that you could help me eliminate them. Alone, Orpheus will be much easier to control. Mm, okay, okay. Yeah, because I put so much time in and because you find out about his deception... small break to clean my glasses because I realize they're very smudged and I'm like why does that look so grainy oh my glasses are filthy um but other than my Astarian run where I ascended him and Gale became a god because that's the run where I slaughtered everyone in the grove and recruited Minthara the old way um I haven't done a truly like evil slash kind of darker playthrough till this one because will is absolutely going to uh become the duke i have to see what i need to do to make that happen though and also will i refuse the option to taste the calamari when it comes Most certainly Orpheus. He is a threat to her reign. Some Githyanki still revere him in defiance of their teachings. Blacketh was safe as long as they believed him to be dead. But as you can see, he is very much alive. She kept him this way oh, because really? she was reluctant to eradicate such power. Power that she might one day wish to take from him. If the Githyanki ever find out what she has done, there will be civil war. Blacketh will be finished. Interesting. There may come a time when that is necessary. Interesting. But there is no guarantee that his power would survive his passing. The risk is too great. The moment his protection is gone, he would become enthralled to the Elder Brain, just as I would. We may look different, but to the Elder Brain, we are already the same. Thrills in its design. You are already more illithid than you realize. It has improved you. You seek to reverse an inevitable process. A process of evolution. When I first escaped from the Elder, I too railed against the change. Okay, look, can you stop gaslighting us? The longer us? I have inhabited this form, the more it has grown on me. Hmm. Even if my original body remained intact after I transformed, I would not return to it. Doing so would only impose limitations. Oh, you mean in the epilogue? As an Alithid, I have far surpassed who I ever was before. Oh, you God. too should embrace this change. You should make an you should make an art with that with the emperor and just do it don't explain just do it i believe we'll have a better chance of defeating the elder brain if you embrace your latent lithid potential nah i've been studying you for a while now i believe i can trigger the next stage of your no, I'm good. life cycle I'll i've seen what you look like when you do that absolutely not you have seen what i can do Imagine yourself with the same strength, the same intelligence, the same devastating beauty. All right, look. If you let me, I can help <laughs> you. No, I, I've i seen what it looks like when you take the astral tadpole. Absolutely not. 
I know there's a mod to make you not look that way. Mm -mm. Even as you say the words, you feel a lurch of disappointment. Your mind bristles with a lithid potential. How could you be so cruel as to deny not yourself what you want most in the world? I felt that. It's your nature. You cannot fight it. Oh, yes, I can. So embrace it. No. Tadpole's going into my pocket and it's never it going out. It wants to evolve, but it cannot do so alone. It must commune with another. Seriously. Ooh. Pray for me, y'all. I will use all of my inspiration to make this not happen. Absolutely not. A wave of disappointment. Stronger than any you've ever felt. And then... Stillness. You've resisted your lithid instincts. For now. Oh, there's no for now. You I'm not becoming one. Yet. Keep hold of it then. Until you are. I probably it just crushed it. It has enough vitality to further your evolution. And your allies. Perhaps you will be more inclined to try it when you see more of what our enemy can do. But we mustn't lose focus. We need to resume our journey. You heard the Chosen. The brain has gone to the city, and the army marches to follow. We must not let them reach it. We must find the brain, and bring it under our son. control. Not gatekeeper son. So, Chelsea, uh, you can stop being a bear now, buddy. Seek and you shall find me. Find his keepers. Like, I'm good. Oh, have you seen what happens? So, Red, I was, I was putzing around on YouTube and I didn't realize this happens. If you challenge Mistra and fail, you die. But also, I love surprises. But also, after you're already dead, Withers leaves you in the in-between. He's like, oh, you thought you were going to Elysium, huh? Surprise. You are not. Oh, yes. That spell. That's a good spell. <laughs> and then Raphael shows up, and I'm like, oh my god. Gale has lost twice in the afterlife. Like, you didn't lose once, you lost twice in the afterlife, bro. Since I'm not romancing Gale, I want to actually try to make him not become a god. Um. Oh, it's... And it's... Because Raphael's like, oh, don't forget, you owe me one soul, buddy. And I'm like, yo, could, could I be dead a whole day? Easy, you know? If I had the talent, I would absolutely make a video of that scene where you fight Mistra. 
with Nuck if you buck. But I do not have the talent, plus I don't want it. I don't want to get a DCMA strike on my YouTube channel. But it just feels like Mr. was like, you can fight. I think I've seen a video about that actually. Where what happens if you're in a lithid and you challenge Mistra? That I I have to I'd have to go look for it. Oh, who's there to talk to? Oh, Lazelle. I never take Lazelle with me anywhere. Your parasite communes with Lazelle's. Her heart races as she learns of the events inside the astral prison. Orpheus, Gith's only son. He lives. It is not the Gaith visitor that Vlakith would destroy and Vos would set free. It is Orpheus, the blood of the mother, the prince of the comet. The who now? Listen close. The Emperor spoke only in half-truths. For you to know the tale of Orpheus, you must know the tale of Gith and of Vlakith. Long ago, when we rose up against our gay slavers, Mother Gith made for the Hells to secure an alliance with the Archdevil Tiamat. Tiamat gifted the Githyanki our red dragons. Gith remained in the Hells, and Tiamat's envoy proclaimed Vlakith our ruler. The first Vlakith of many. It is Vlakith 157 whom my people now call Queen. Orpheus was, is, Gith's only son. He led his mother's own honor guard in a coup against Vlakith 1. It was Kithrak Vos himself who slayed the prince in vicious battle. Or so the Varshis teach us. Yet the Prince of the Comet's been with us, what subdued the fuck? by that repugnant illithid. Should Orpheus go free, Sorry, he would the tear Vlakith's empire to pieces and build new glory from the scraps. Sorry, I need to look into this because that keeps happening when I wear my headphones. The audio just jumps from the speaker to the headphone, speaker to the headphone, and it's random. Orpheus is not just a Gith Yankee. He is Mother Gith's blood. Every word Voss spoke, he spoke true. Orpheus is the living proof of the Queen's lies, and the living weapon that conquered our Gaith slavers. One word from his lips, and the people would doubt. Two words, and they would rage. Three words, and they would bow to the true heir. If the Gith Yankee are to be free, the Prince of the Comet must lead the way. So does Lazelle leave then if you side with the Emperor? I wonder how that works if you uh, don't have that great of a relationship with her. Oh, is it like a 30 BC or something? We must find where Gortash and Orin have established themselves and take their nether stones. I'm gonna need you to leave me alone, Emperor. Could come in handy. Oh shit. I might fail Two that then. Time. So it's persuasion? Right? Just a peek. I 
also have a mild concern over how much rope is just randomly laying around Faerun. Oh yeah, I totally forgot to turn that back on. Good job, man. Um, also... I must not have the St. Jude alerts on this overlay. Well... Is there a way to avoid Yenna? Because I really just am like, must I help this child? Oh no, she's coming over here. Are you serious? Um, oh my god. Me. I can't find my mom. Okay, what do you want me to do about it? But, um, I'm. I don't know where to go. Damn, I... Tad harsh, don't you think? Our fire will be no cooler just for sharing it with a child in need. Gail. Did you all see Gail, th that this child just walked up to me? That's the first thing I did. Mum always said to look for a temple if I needed help. But they... They said they couldn't help me because of the circ circum circumstances. That's what they said. The game really said you will not avoid this child. The place was empty. Keep those thugs away from my family. Ah, gotcha. Get these spotters out of my house now! Arthur, sweetheart, you paid me and my boys to be caravan guards, not cattle wranglers. If you want us to get our hands dirty, it'd be our pleasure. But that'll be extra. This is my home. All right, I have a good one, Liz. My Safe travel. But I draw the line at being a halfway house. Zenobia and I are just navigating a slight contractual disagreement. Not that it's any of your concern. Why should I negotiate with the vermin who've stolen my house? I've got nothing to say to them. I guess we're all you've got then, Arthur. Want your house squeaky clean? Cough up! Ugh. This is the last time I hire someone from the guild. Fine. Here's the extra. Finish the job. Come on, boys. Let's take out the trash. No, 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 no. Don't you dare lay a finger on them. Oh, shit. Job done. Whatever's left is yours to sort out. <gasps> wow. Wow, I've never seen them just do that. The Rivington rats don't waste any time, do they? I can see why they were so highly recommended. Anyway, 
I have a lot to do now those squatters are out of my hair. Goodbye. Okay, then. These squatters. I should put bear traps under the windows next time. Wow. That was rude. Oh, absolutely. Where is my car? Actions have not gone unnoticed. If they persist, it seems they will not go unpunished. Oh, so that's Keep what we're doing? Stuff. Cool. Finally. Your actions are pushing tempers to the limit. Persist, and things may get out of hand. Okay, how, how much fucking health does he have? Because now this is just getting ridiculous. I mean, he's humbled now. He's quite dead. I was gonna be like, how much more health does this fucker have? What's in here? That's curious. Like, how much health you got? With pleasure. Um, there's a slight chance I may hop over to Doug Cockle if he goes live. Because he's, uh, he hit a point where he got very stuck in the Grim Forge. Um, and I offered to be on voice if he needed help. But I have not heard from him today, so I don't know if he's going to stream. Yeah. Oh, Nasty dear. surprise. Yeah. Someone should have to trap out here. for us. I actually really hate oh, this dear. whole last area. Someone's left a trap out for us. <laughs> Sell bread. Cool. Jesus Christ. Oh dear. Someone's left a trap out for us. I'm okay. I'm live because I woke up before the chickens again. Um. Oh, I jumped too. Dirty 20. I'm just like, there is... And I had no plans to stream this weekend. I was actually going to try to get stuff done around the house. But it's like, well, I'm awake. My hair appointment's not till 12.30, so... generous soul. It might be worth looking into his donations. Who knows what he's been giving. Yeah, I was able to get in because I realized I haven't I haven't been in a while and uh, I'm traveling this weekend and then I'll be in Seattle for work 
for a week in June, and then I go to Rotterdam, so... Oh, we're a fangirl. Oh, Carlac. Well, I have as much energy as a wet paper bag today, so I'm absolutely probably going to fall asleep. A trap. Someone doesn't like visitors. Fun. Baldur's Gate is a gorgeous game. A hero at heart. Easy enough. Wow, he was just straight up hoarding food. This dude was just straight hoarding food. What have we here? In this economy where people are starving, you are just hoarding food. How are you, word fangirl? Oh, absolutely. You 200% deserve getting got. By the gory gods. What's all that shaking about? It felt like a quake fit to topple Ramazeth Tower. I'm okay. I'm, I'm tired and... No trouble at all. I realize part of my anxiety is because I've got... A doctor's appointment. Oh, I've got several doctor's appointments coming up. Arthur availed himself of the Drow Twins. Oh, now I get the basement key after I've locked it. Thanks, game. Ooh, Marshember wine.
So do I. Um, it's mostly follow-ups, but it still makes me anxious. Well, Monday's follow-ups. I remember we are still raising money for St. Jude. We're only $140 away from our goal. Oh, I absolutely had to do that. I actually started a stream and then took my meds. Everything hurts this morning. I've only been on an hour. It feels like I've been on much longer. Just a peek. I don't want to steal from him. I'm like, I just want to help. Also, what is... Oh, jumping is missing. How do I keep doing that? So mine literally have to stay on my desk. If I put them anywhere else, they do not get taken. I'm very bad about it if they're literally not right in front of me. So my two daily meds now stay on my desk. So they're not there, like literally in front of me. I will 200% forget until way too late in the day. Exactly, Red. Like, I forgot to take, um, I forgot to take my iron pills for almost a week because I put them in the kitchen for some reason. If you won't help us, at least let the children in. They've had nothing but scraps for days. Investigator. Brilgorn might have been a criminal, but he was no murderer. You're missing something. You have to be. Enough, Yanis. Listen to yourself. You are defending a man who ritually slaughtered your high priest. The evidence speaks for itself. Brilgor killed Father Lorgan, then, be it out of shame or profane duty, offed himself with the same blade. Man, Valeria can kiss my entire Sister ass. Yannis. I also really don't like Valeria because Shiny of the... Shiny little elephant. Oh, um, I apologize, stranger. Because of the implication... Language like that hardly befits a rector of Ilmater. ...of blaming refugees for someone's murder, and I really hate that implication. Also... I don't know if it's intentional or not, but the whole, the, the temple is not taking care of the people most at need. I'm like, if that's not a fucking allegory for certain religious things. Thank you. I wouldn't normally speak so harshly, but these are rather unique circumstances. Two people just died on temple grounds. Our high priest, Father Logan, and one of the new refugees, Brilgor. Investigator Valeria thinks it's a murder and is content to blame Brilgor, the politically convenient target. Brilgor was a refugee. No one sticks up for them at the best of times and with Gortash in power. Well. I expect the flaming fists will ban refugee aid now one of them's blamed for murder. This is a little too on the nose right now. 
Where are our Vardos? You think Ilmata looks at a Baldarian differently to anyone else? I like to think the gods are smarter than that. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a temple to run and a high priest to replace. Uh, that's modded selenite armor. <gasps> right? So far, so good. Just, uh... I'm only on because I could not sleep. Oh, it's a holophant. I had no intent of streaming this weekend at all, especially once I got in for a hair appointment later today, because that will be the rest of my day. Uh, no, it's not weird. It's just I'm usually awake, and also our urban bohemian is normally on now, but he's an hour ahead of me, but he's traveling, so no stream today. Um, it's not really weird, just it's the weekend. Most of us are not up. There you go, Red. Now actually, take a moment to enjoy Will's armor while I go get more coffee. Because I definitely need more coffee. So hang out for a hot second, I'll be right back. It can also be a ref for my commission, Red. Of exactly this. Exactly this. Hey, bees. All right, coffee, BRB. Hey, Jari, I'm sorry you're sick. Uh, what kind of coffee does everyone like while we're sitting here? Hey, sometimes you need coffee in a can. When I did my year abroad in Japan, absolutely lived off coffee in a can out of vending machines because I was in a dorm and so I couldn't, we didn't really have coffee. Oh, nope. Don't want to click on the books. They'll be like. The crying uh, one weeps today. Our father Logan is dead. Really? Murdered. This is now cup two. I. I don't want to talk. My heart is in Boss mourning. coffee. Yep. I don't think I can get boss coffee here. If I can, I'm in trouble. If I found a way to get iced coffee, I already found out I can get iron brew here in the US. I the of exactly no one needs this. to tell me exactly this. Th 
We let more outsiders in, and more Baldurians die. Duke Stelney, Father Lorcan, it's no coincidence. Imagine fleeing to the city, only to be met with suspicion. The refugees uh, face hardship at every turn. Here. We have faith Are you sure here, today? Ben. Faith in people, no matter where they're from. Who had more faith than Father Lorcan? How did that work out? I don't know if that was a flavor when I was last in Japan. Exactly. Logan let a killer into our temple due to his misguided compassion. His faith got him murdered. Bill, I beg you, be quiet. Even sinners receive ill-mated grace, and Father Logan knew that. We don't pick and choose who we aid. Be more like Brother Clements. Be more like this man. I have not had Death Wish. I have gifted someone Death Wish, but I have not had it myself. This is reminding me though, I do need to order some groceries so that I can cook later. I may, I've been living off tray bakes and that's probably not the best thing, but it's the easiest thing to do. Thank you, stranger. I take some solace knowing that he died in Ilmater's service. Does Ilmater's service involve protecting heretic absolutists? Oh, perhaps I missed that sermon. Enough, Bill. You seem a kind soul. Our temple is open to you. Walk well. Ooh, chicken. Why not? We are his adherents. Nice. Bill sounds like he needs to remember why he's a, why he's a priest. Much like many people I have met in real life. I claim to be very religious. Really, lady? Why so? I've said all I have to say already. To who? Now I just, I just want met to pack you. up my kitchen and leave. <laughs> Investigator. That miniature mastodon is about as much use as rats in the pantry or flies in the sea. Ah, uh, gotcha. Father Logan's gone. Murdered. And now they're blaming a refugee for it. He was attacked in the cellar. He had a private altar down there. He used to like the solitude. <laughs> the man ate like a horse. A soup-hungry horse. Mm, Usually soup. took enough to feed a small clergy down there. Look, I need to finish up here. Lots of soup to clean up. I... Blood, too. He is. He is very cute. Would you like a reference screenshot before I go in the basement, Red? <gasps> but soup! I want to steal the soup! Uh, don't be sorry. He is cute. Also, his name is Donic, which is a Dragon Age reference. I swear the people who made this game must be big Dragon Age fans because there's too many things that relate back to Dragon Age. Look, if I can be of service, I am happy to do so. Also, I have questions about why there's so much rope laying around Faerun. Like, why is there so much rope? Like, what were y'all doing? Also, rope is very coarse and thick. So if it's actual rope, like I'm thinking, that, how big is this barrel? Soup does sound good, yeah? Ooh, I can make Instapot soup. Oh, rotten lemon. Bleh. I like how watermelon is not actually watermelon. Red, were you in chat yesterday? Were you lurking? Um, so Halson was necky for some reason. 
His modded outfit didn't show up properly. He was not only naked, he, um, he was sans twig and berries, shall we say. And it was, I have to go make a clip of it because it was just, yo, why? What's happening? Yes, Kendall Halson, and I have no idea what was going on. It was toward the end of the stream. We had, uh, no, I don't have that mod. God, I don't want that mod. That's me. I don't want it. Um, no, so... What comes now? Halson's outfit. Basically, everyone is wearing modded outfit now that I realized it at least this party. And I went into, I went to camp and I changed his outfit. And instead, he had like nothing. He had just arms. And I was like, what's happening? Why does he have just arms? And so I put like a regular non-modded outfit and it eventually showed up. But I took the outfit off entirely, and he was smooth as a Ken doll, and I was very concerned. Oh, now he has on underwear. Interesting. Okay, those are some, like, snug undies, bro. Those are not. How many different outfits do you have? Okay, that's the one without the sleeve, the shoulders. Seriously? So, see, I put this cape on, it does not display properly. Well, our, our, I'm gonna. I keep tripping on your name. My brain wants to say Ardvark, and I know that's not it. Way from Waterdeep, where am I needed? So I'm so sorry. I keep almost mispronouncing your name because I see it, and the brain wants to say Ardvark, and I don't know why. Or you don't need an imagination. It was a very weird graphical glitch in the moment, and I'm like, why, why? No, it's fine. It's just, I'm clearly, I'm struggling today, y'all. Um, I also want to be respectful. I don't want to just change people's names. You know, I don't like people changing my name or somehow they add of the year to my username and I have no idea. Right? Those leggings are like, bro, I hope you're not trying to sire no little cubs because... I don't know if that's going to work out for you. Hmm. It's just like a... Today's a tongue twister day, apparently. Oh, no. Is there anything we can do to help, Red? Careful. Stop. Uh, stop. Not 350 years with no kids. Oh yeah, this is like a weird. What have we here? Space. Oh, that's been me for a while. I have not been able to do any writing outside of work for quite a while. I have a book chapter that's so overdue. I'm surprised these people have not yelled at me. Oh, that's so dope. Watch your back. I don't remember if this is actually worth going through all this to disarm it. Well, my thing is, or people, so while we're doing this, because I can do this and not think. Um. How do you all feel when you go into chats and people I'll just help myself? Like 
either mangle your name or... I don't know why I took that. That should go to Gail. Also, hello. Oh, I think... Aren't the no... Well... I think the gnomes are here. There. This is underneath something. Oh. Okay, so I hear people on the other side of that door. Money, rope, and wines. That might be like a good time. Oh my god. Yesterday, so Neil and Tom were playing Baldur's Gate yesterday. And Tom picked up pork loin. And Neil called it a pork cock. And I was like, I quit. I cannot. Yo! Who fighting? We just got here. He, without missing a beat, said a pork cock. On the double. Um... Agent Mulder, Alex and I were chatting while Neil was live. And we both had a, did he just say that? Like, did he literally just say that? And we're like, yep, yeah, he sure did. I just was, you know how I did, you know, for those of us of an age, To remember oh my god I can't we reach carry the day. seriously Halson you missed bro I know you're 350 but you can't make that shot okay Oh, this, this better be good. I just I just Two lost it time. because thankfully I was not on a call, but I, I had to miss a lot of stream at least hearing it because I was in work meetings. I also needs something. I'm like, how did you miss that shot? You were literally right there. Oh, I, I've seen some... Only a broken mind can create such a sick scene as this. I've seen Professor Halson fan art, and while I tell you... Not sure what I expected to find. But organs and entrails were not in my top 20. Oh, this is perfect to find this before I even get to the city. Professor Halson. There, there's, um, there's a AU kind of thing happening with Baldur's Gate where a lot of people will draw Astarian or Raphael as priests. Like modern AU type things. And uh, there's been a lot of Professor Halson AUs. I don't remember, I'd have to look, but if you, if you Google, Profes I'm sure if you do Professor Halson as a Twitter or Tumblr search, you'll find some. Yes, and Professor Gale, much more Professor Gale. I've seen one Priest Halson and I was like, I, I don't, Sith Starian? Interesting. Sith Starian? Huh. 
Huh. I've never pondered that before. I guess? Now I'm like, I have not seen this. The what are you? Imagine Ascended Sith Starion. So I feel like Ascended Asterion would have to be a Sith. Okay, that is a whole ass barrel and there's only one random banana in it. Yeah, normally my Fridays are not full of meetings, but yesterday was a special hell of full of meetings. So I missed a lot of hearing the stream. Let's see. I need to get back to my fanfic I was writing. Rotten Mater. Quite empty. I've seen Ice Skater AU with Gale. Physical Therapist Halson? Interesting. I have not seen Physical Therapist Halson at all. That would be kind of fascinating, actually. Hockey player? Well, I have never seen that. That that intrigues. <gasps> the medallion. Does, is this to say where he has me. the medallion? Oh, this isn't the save where he has the monk medallion. The book is locked tight with no visible keyhole. Only an oval recess in the cover's mouth. You try to examine the book, but the longer you stare, the more those piercing amethyst eyes draw you in. You feel the darkness radiating from the book. Jory, you must share. Delicious. Gale doing it as a I'll show you mages are not weak. Oh wait, that's Anders. Oh. Gale disapproves. You just want the book for yourself, Gale. The book's pull is irresistible. You feel changed, bettered for having opened it. Suddenly you are capable of anything. Felling mountains, darkening suns, conversing with the dead. Oh my god. Glyphs shift gently before your eyes. Words slip into your mind, onto your lips, forming words you don't understand. And something Ooh, is trying oh, to reply. Red. red. <gasps> How much money can I throw at you for that if it helps break well, your art block? Quite the page turner. I'll get back to it when I have more time to focus. So Red, how much money can I throw at you to make this happen? Would it help your art block in any way? 
I have no shame. None. None at all. But wait, what about Bull Halson? Especially if you get Halson's dialogue about the years he spent captured by the drow in a pleasure house. Imagine. I have no shame. Okay, but here's the thing though. So this has now set my brain in motion and maybe I'll try to write it on my phone while I'm getting my hair done. Imagine, imagine if they all went to Charessa's caress, they hire the drow twins, but Bull, because he's a Ben Hasrath, notices that Astarian's not into it. What? There's sheep behind your house? Just random sheep? Why? Red, why are there sheep just there? Sorry, I'm thrown off by the random sheep now. Wait, they use sheep to mow the lawns? Gortash has been crowned Archduke. Maybe we should get to Worm's Rock and crash that party. That's amazing and also ingenious. I've never seen that. I live like in the city in the city, so I have never seen that. The pride of the gate. I must see the sheepies. Oh goodness, sheep. Sheeps. Okay, now I just kind of want to come to your neighborhood and see the sheeps. No worries. Enjoy, Arv. Thanks for hanging out. I'm also just sending a bunch of things to you to camp because Will's carrying too much shit. Oh, the vivacious cloak works really well with this armor. Hello. I should go to Lazelle, actually. Have a great night. Oh my goodness. Uh, throw those in Discord if you want. Like just random sheeps. Ah, uh, the Zanbowl. I don't want it. No. I'm also seeing like, what in the actual fuck am I wearing? Uh, Gail should probably have that actually. Definitely send that to Shadowheart since she uh, decided to murder the Night Song. For those that were not here yesterday, I let Shadowheart make up her own mind. And uh, she shanked the Night Song. And I was like, what's happening? She just straight up was like, a 
Oh, we need to find somewhere to sell all this shit. You can't accidentally put this in your wares. Interesting. Oh, I already know. Gail knows Arcane Lock, so. All right, enough faffing around. I thought this was the save where Astarian had the monks. Had the monk amulet where he like wants you to bring it here specifically. Interesting, these corpses literally have nothing. Easy enough. Also, who laid these people to rest? Why are they. Sorry, my brain just went. This is some of the worst necromancy. Like, y'all just put people in cof coffins. Yeah, I was surprised. I let her make her own she decision, and she she shanked the night song. And I was like, oh, well, shit. Oh, that's where I just came from. I'm turned around. Oh wait, what am I doing? I feel like I can... Nope, I keep going in there. That's not where I wanna go. Oh, I've made a circle. find the crime scene yeah I uh I was like oh well that happened am I missing the ladder it keeps saying iron ladder on the on the map and I'm like where Am I just absolutely missing this? I sure am. Good here? job, man. Anyway, how's everyone doing? I'm very excited for Rotterdam, Brad. So I've been to Amsterdam, I've never been to Rotterdam. Oh yeah, we need a guitar. Mr. Decadios. I mean, yes, but it's a city that's not where I live. So Jory, you mean like Popeye's kind of biscuits or British kind of biscuits? Coming? I know that symbol in the collar. This wing cat thing must be Gales. <gasps> Not wing cat thing. Ah. So funny story. A friend of mine who's Finnish years ago came to visit. And they stayed with me, and we ordered Popeyes. They just were flummoxed by Popeyes biscuits. 
to the point that they posted on Facebook about it. And I had to endure these UK people for almost their whole visit, seeing their post and being flummoxed about savory biscuits. And I was like, can you untag me? Because I am not okay with all of this. That can't be you, can it? My, is that a ring? For us? Oh, you shouldn't have. Enjoy yourself now, Tara. Looks like you've got yourself set up quite nicely here. She isn't my Trezin. Wow. She's my friend. And from the looks of things, it appears she's eating pigeons. Oh, right. Did you hear that, Tara? Um, stop it. Oh, she's agreed. Just about. I thought Tara could speak to you regardless. Civilization beckons at last. It's no water deep, right? but Baldur's Gate is a respectable runner up. Or at least a close third. I did do Haggai on Gale. I can only imagine what I could do were I to adopt the biology of a mind flare. Gale, no. You've not taken this power for yourself. So I can only wonder why offer it to me? Oh no, I don't want him to become a mind flayer. I I don't want you to become a mind flayer, Gail. Good lord. No. Oh, same. Because I did the replacer, he always has a bun. I don't know about making him a mind flayer. But now that Red said that about Gale and becoming a mind flayer and challenging Mr., I kind of want to do it. <clears throat> I'm sorry, what? You can become a god mind flayer? Get out. No way. Citizens only. I won't say it again. Wow, God Gale Mind Flayer. Oh, Rogue's Morsel. Thank you. Gaslight God kill my This better be good. Red, I do so enjoy having you in chat. We're gonna be terrible when we are together in person, my god. No, it just you're right. No, this is not a hinge piling. These are great ideas. Also, you're very chill about like lore stuff and you ask first, which is great. Because a lot of people come in and they just want to lore dump without realizing I probably know what they're asking about. Or what they're trying to talk about. Because there are people who have come in Ground and just... Shaking again. Can't say I like it. Absolutely. There's something happening. We've had a couple people come in and just really, really want to lore dump. Finders keepers. Oh, absolutely. 
I always want to hear dev stories. Oh, the story is I'll, I'll be able to tell once we ship our game. I'm sorry, what? There was never an upper city? We'll see what we can do. Oh, you know what? Now that you say that, I remember those articles. It was trapped. Well, shit. Stop. Pushing on. I forgot that was trapped. Good job, me. Yeah, that, that that scoping sounds so familiar. So familiar. Hammer. Nasty surprise. Caution is warranted here. Nasty surprise. Caution is warranted here. And I, I'm just telling y'all right now, once our game comes out, I'm going to disappear off the internet. Nobody gets to ask me shit about that game. No, because I, I don't have the patience. I would get in trouble, potentially fired, the minute somebody starts talking shit about the game. I should also save. I've done a lot without saving. You thought I would have learned my lesson from this before. Oh, Oren. Ugh. Come to finish the job. No one's innocent round here. Ugh. Maybe you're better nah, than most. Red, I just... Ugh. By the gods, it hurts. I will not have the Help patience me. for it. Please. Sam's on. We should go raid Sam. Ellis. I think once I get past this, I'll probably, I'll hit two no. hours. It's too late for that. No portion of spell can fix this. <sighs> get this blade out of me. Use it. Kill me. Kill me now. Because I'm hitting a wall since I woke up so early. What are you doing? Stop! No! Ah! 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 <laughs> Stop it! That tickles. I forgot Sam was streaming. I feel a little bad. Oren freaks me out. Maggie did such an amazing job. I still feel like she should have won so many awards. Oh, Steven, you're back. Are you streaming today? So, you're the lick spittle who crushed the Bone Lord's thrall. <laughs> have you come b begging, sniffing for our stones? Gortash won't like that. A throat his black hand can't choke the spit from. 
He will try to bind your brutality Meg is funny. Every time I to see make her. you spin the suffering for his noose. She forgets that we met. When you find the Lord, except Ring, for last time, tell him Orin is watching. <laughs> A shapeshifter. Orin can take any form she pleases, including ours. All right. I also have not actually uncovered any place but okay we're going back to rivington i'm gonna say so i'm just kind of hitting the wall being awake so early is hitting me oh i adore maggie she's great i missed in my first playthrough too But I'm kind of hitting a wall and I'm hungry, so I'm gonna go make proper breakfast. Um, and then depending on how late my hair appointment goes, I'm trying to talk Pirate and Mandy into Dead by Daylight. Don't know if we'd stream it if we do play. Soup or chorizo con huevos. Because uh, I have that as well. Uh, we're gonna go raid Sam, uh, DM Jazzy Hands partner who's resumed streaming on weekends. I think he's playing Stardew? Maybe? Yeah, chorizo con huevos. I have so many eggs, I need to use them all. Well, let's see what Sam's doing. It's a chance to go raid. Uh, he's lovely. Hopefully I get to see him soon. And uh, I may stream when I get home. It all depends. Or maybe not till Monday morning. But either way, see y'all later. Bye. You'll be in a big...